Hi, I'm Richard St. John, author of Eight to Be Great. My story started about 10 years ago on a plane, and in the seat next to me was a teenage girl. She came from a really poor family, but she wanted to get somewhere in life. And she asked me a simple question, what really leads to success? And yet, even though I'd achieved some success, I couldn't tell her how I did it. I mean, how did a dunce like me, who barely passed high school, end up becoming a millionaire? So I get off the plane and go to a conference. And I'm standing in a room full of the rich and famous when it hit me. Why don't I ask them what helped them succeed and find out what really leads to success? Now here we are 10 years later, and I've interviewed over 500 very successful people, including many of the world's greats. The big job has been analyzing and sorting the millions of words I got in the interviews. But after all that work, I discovered the eight to be great. The eight traits that lead to great success. Love what you do. Work really hard. Focus on one thing, not everything. Keep pushing yourself. Come up with good ideas. Keep improving yourself and what you do. Serve others something of value. And persist, because there really is no overnight success. The first trait that makes people great is passion. When I asked Russell Crowe what led to his Academy Award for Best Actor, he said the bottom line is I love the actual job of acting. I have a great passion for it. Successful people do it for love, not money. When Bill Gates and Paul Allen started Microsoft, Bill says, Paul and I, we never thought we would make much money. We just loved writing software. And the cool thing is, if you do it for love, the money comes anyway. The second trait that makes people great is work. All successful people work really hard. Martha Stewart said to me, I'm a real hard worker. I work and work and work all the time. Media tycoon Rupert Murdoch said it's all hard work. Nothing comes easily, but I have a lot of fun. Did he say fun? Yes, successful people have fun working. That's why I say they're not workaholics. They're work of frolics. The third trait that makes people great is focus. Famous filmmaker Norman Jewison said to me, I think it all has to do with focusing yourself to one thing and one thing only. Now many people don't focus, they dabble. And that's okay to get started. But to succeed at anything, we really have to narrow down and focus on one thing. The fourth trait that makes people great is push. Great people just keep pushing themselves. Richard Branson said to me, whatever you're doing in life, just push yourself to the limits. We've got to push through shyness. I'm amazed at how many successful people are incredibly shy. They just keep pushing through it. And they keep pushing through self-doubt. Goldie Hawn said to me, I always had self-doubts. I wasn't good enough. I wasn't smart enough. I didn't think I'd make it. And she made it just fine as both an actress and producer. Now, it's not always easy to push yourself, and that's why they invented mothers. When I asked Frank Gehry, the famous architect, what led to his success, he said, my mother pushed me. So find somebody to push you. These are some of the other ways you can push yourself to success. The fifth trait that makes people great is ideas. One good idea has taken many people from the bottom to the top. Bill Gates says, I had an idea, founding the first microcomputer software company. And that one good idea certainly took Bill to the top. Now, ideas are all about creativity, but I don't like the word creative because there's a myth that only artsy people are creative. In reality, everybody is creative. And I worked with many business people over the years who are just as creative as the artists. As Donald Trump says, deals are my art form. There's no magic to coming up with great ideas. It just means doing some very simple things that anybody can do. Number six, improve. Successful people are on a continuous mission to improve themselves and what they do. How do we improve? It can be summed up in three words. Practice, practice, practice. I mean, when Lance Armstrong was asked how he won the Tour de France for the seventh time, he simply said, the difference is that my team practices 12 months of the year not three or four. Number seven, serve. Successful people don't just serve themselves. They serve others something of value. And I don't mean in just a charity sense, because serving others is how people really get rich. I mean, just look at a list of the top billionaires, and you'll see they all get rich by serving others something of value. Whether it's Bill Gates serving a software, or, or Sam Walton serving us discounts at Walmart, or Martha Stewart serving us homemaking tips. Martha said to me, I came to people with trusted information, useful information, valuable ideas and products. There's that word value again. And that's what made Martha America's first 
female self-made billionaire. The eighth trait that makes people great is persist. We've got to persist through time because there really is no overnight success. Larry Page, co-founder of Google, said to me, it takes a long time to do these things, and a lot of success is just due to the amount of time you put into it. We've got to persist through crap, which stands for criticism, rejection, adversity, and prejudice. And we've got to persist through failure, because all successful people fail. Robert Ward, senior VP at Universal Studios, said to me, you really have to persist because it won't be easy and there will be failure. You need to pick yourself up, stay on course, and continue down that path. Trust me, after 10 years of research, I can tell you these are the top eight traits that lead to great success in any field. And the great thing is they're all simple things that anybody can do. I'm not saying success is easy, but the traits that lead to success are easy to understand and implement in our own lives. So here's to your success, whatever that means to you. Thanks so much for listening, and be great.